Okay, today we have the 2017 Crosstrek in. Uh, it's very similar to the previous generation, but a lot of changes. So as far as the Amber Delete kit, that's very popular for the previous generation. We sold a lot of those. Um, headlights very similar, but very different at the same time. Uh, the overlay that we have on here right now is a smoked version. I've already started to take it off, but before I get taking it off, I want to show you guys the difference. This is the smoked version. So you'll see that you can still see some of the orange through it. It has the blacked out look. If you come over here, you can see the stock side a lot of orange in it not really cool so the purpose of the amber delete kit is to get rid of that make the headlight look more aggressive and another thing that it does is it makes this whole sea light a lot more prominent let's get to the removal first so I'll show you what it's like to remove it overlay very simple uh, it should be the same way in a year from now two years from now removes just as easy with a little bit of heat this is the transparent film so like I said, it gives it that smoked effect. The more popular of the two versions is gonna be the gloss black. So there's no transparency to it, but it does look a lot cleaner, I think. In regards to the install, all you wanna do is clean up the headlight. What we use is the isopropyl alcohol, wipe it down with the uh, microfiber, and it's clean at that point. The goal is to get rid of any waxes, any debris that's on there. Brand new car, super clean, don't really gotta worry about much. What you wanna do is you wanna line it from the corner and you'll notice that this corner falls into line with this shape in here. And then from there, it's just setting the vinyl into place. And you'll see that it falls and just falls right into, into place with the headlight. So what I like to do is kind of create like a hinge point from here. I'll work all this down and I'll work the other way. side laid now. Now I can go ahead and come back over here, work from my line this way. you notice with the material it's repositionable so once it sits into place or once you set it down no big deal you can actually pick it up and lift it off. The only thing you want to do is be sure not to stretch it so do this in a, a nice cool temperature because if it is hot the material will start to warp and move around. You don't want that. You want it to be nice and cool. Do it in the garage early in the morning before the vehicle has been started up for the day. So I'm just going to make this bend here. Now this is all laid, so we can kind of start working our way forward. So once the overlay is laid into place, the last thing you want to do is you want to trim it out. And uh, you need to use a nice sharp blade because you want to make sure that it cuts through the material. You're more so just scoring the vinyl and not cutting the light, so it's a very, very light press. And you're gonna use the indentation on the headlight to make this cut. So that's the entire install, really easy to do. Just wipe it down and you're good to go. The product's available on premiumautostyling.com. If you guys have any other questions about any of the products we have available for the cross truck or any other vehicle maker model, comment below, we'd be happy to help you. Premiumautostyling.com.